I'd like to ask you to focus your attention on this yellow liquid that I have in this flask. And I have also a beaker of this size and a bigger beaker. What I want to do is put the yellow liquid into this beaker uh, without spilling it. And just to make sure that I don't make uh, uh, a mistake here, I'm going to put the smaller beaker inside the bigger one and just pour the liquid in there because I want to fill it up very carefully all the way to the top. Actually, I want to add some more. <laughs> so all of it is in there. All of it is in there. You see that? Hey, what happened to the beaker? What happened to the small beaker? Is it still there? No. Can you see it? No. It's invisible, right? But it's there. I take this glass rod and I put it in there. See, it taps against it. It taps again. Wait a minute. What happened to the rod? Did the rod disappear too? You can see the rod that's not in the yellow liquid is still visible, but the other one is invisible, right? So let me turn this around a little bit like this, see if this helps a little bit better, all right? So uh, this is a good way to hide things, isn't it? So <laughs> I, I have some more uh, small rods here, glass rods, you see? I want to hide them, so I drop them inside the smaller beaker. And I'll tell you what this yellow liquid is. It's a little bit, it's, a, it's actually quite a bit of, uh, of oil, vegetable oil, with a little bit of baby oil in it. And what I'm dropping in there, and what this smaller beaker is made of, and what this glass rod is made of, uh, they're made of Pyrex. And so they um, uh, reflect and refract light differently. That's why the, you can't see what's inside um, the, uh, the bigger beaker. But I want to assure you, I want to assure you that that beaker is in there. So I want to pick it up and show it to you. It's right there, see? Right there. All right, so I put it back in here because yeah, I want to uh, hide it. And um, so I move on now. Um, you know, some of these experiments you can do at home, uh, but you don't have Pyrex at home, but that's okay. But uh, many other experiments you can do at home if you go to my website, scifun.org, S-C-I-F-U-N.org, uh, and then you can download the experiments and do them uh, at home. So let me now ask you to focus your attention on this glass dish that I have over here. This glass dish has in it what looks like uh, white jello, but it's not really jello. Uh, it looks like white jello. And what I'm going to do is take a clear and colorless liquid, water. I'm going to add the water in there, and we'll see what happens. Can you read that? Yeah. What does it say? Science is fun. And you know what? The, those those uh, white jello-like uh, chunks that were in there, what, what do you think happened to them? They seem to have disappeared, right? But they're still in there. Here, I'll show you. They're still in there. So another thing that everyone who's interested in science can really learn, if you study science and you learn it very well, not only can you make certain things disappear, but you can make other things appear here. This program is available on DVD for $30 from Educational Innovations. For ordering information, call them toll-free at 1-888-912-7474 or check their website at www.teachersource.com.